Hey everybody, what is up? This is your boy Z-Man welcoming you back to part 16 of Pokemon Black Let's Play. In the last part we made it across the massively, hugely large bridge to Castilia City and we found out that Bianca lost her Pokemon. Come on, Bianca, seriously. Oh, and we're about to meet Iris! You did everything you could. But it's... but that's so bad! Taking people's Pokemon is really bad. It's really nice when people and Pokemon are together. They each have something the other doesn't, and they help each other. <clears throat> oh man, Iris is so smart about this. Although she is annoying in the anime. Iris agreed. No fear. We will get the Pokemon back. Right, Z? Right. Having said that, finding a person or a Pokemon here in Castilia City will be like finding a needle in a haystack because the city is so freaking huge. Oh my goodness. Where'd that guy come from? It's Team Plasma guy gonna lead us what an idiot he's gonna come down here to lead us right to the nice I spy a gym leader last time went so well I thought I'd grab another Pokemon I'm rethinking what are you computer recalculating yeah you need to get out of here so that we can follow you and chase you let's go and Iris is gonna take over the bodyguard position in the game of Bianca because she's too weak and, uh, she's not strong enough to hold on to her own Pokemon against Patrats. Or s actually, Patrats and Sandals. Okay, you be Bianca's bodyguard, and I'll go after the bad guys. Good idea. So now we're gonna go back into the main part of the city. The amazingly, hugely big city of Castilia City. And all we have to do is come right over here. I remember the place is right next to the Pokemon Gym. See, there's Berg. What are you doing? That way! Mm-hmm. They're heading towards the gym. That's true. I'm trying to steal your Pokemon, Burry. Go get after him. And if we come right up here, as you can see up there, there's Berg and a few Team Plasma idiots. This is definitely the place. Good to know. No one's here. Not a soul, except for the three people standing guard right outside. No, none of the, <laughs> no other Team Plasma members or the Seven Sages are inside. Let me guess, there's a few sa Seven Sages guy in there. Maybe we could take him down once and for all. If you think I'm lying, why don't you have a little battle to find out? Yeah, sure, why not? I had a thought I'll take care of the weak-looking grunt, so you can show off by handling that tough-looking guy over there. Oh, you think you can beat me? I'm the tough-looking one. I'm about to kick Berg's butt in a Pokemon battle in a maybe next part. Possibly this part, I don't even know. I do have some other stuff I want to do before we, before we challenge him. We were challenged by the Team Plasma Grunt, who sent out a Sandile. Much better than Patrat, but still not hard to beat at all. And I sent out Luna because I forgot to switch my Pokemon. So let's send out Wart. Its Timpoles and Bubbles can easily destroy Sandiles. Crocodiles lose to Bubbles all the time, we already know that. Honestly, a battle between a Crocodile and a uh, Tadpole. Who wins? Tadpole every time. I know, makes sense, doesn't it, guys? But one little bubble beam should take care of the sand dial. One shot, done. And this other Pokemon is another sand dial. I do not want to switch my Pokemon, I don't know, I hit that. But he's got another sand dial. Which, you know, guess what we're gonna do, guys? Guess, guess, just take a guess. You got your guess? Okay, you said bubble beam, you're correct. Go, bubbles! Is there anything better in a Pokemon game than killing a crocodile using bubbles shot at him from a tadpole? This is so unrealistic, a crocodile versus a tadpole. Come on, seriously, all I did was take some people's Pokemon. Okay, you stole, it's okay, I'll let you go for that. Oh, back away slowly. This is bad. Bad, 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 bad. Bad for Team Plasmore. Or Pla- <laughs> Okay, that guy, I actually like that guy now, that guy's awesome. Plasbad. I'm gonna start using that word. Anytime we beat a pla Team Plasma Matter, it's Plasbad for him. It's my best interest to go report to the Seven Sages right now. And they go inside. Wonder what we should do. He got lost. Couldn't even figure out what the uh, cross transceiver. Team Plasma's inside. The po stolen Pokemon wait, may be in there as well. I can't talk. It's amazing. Okay, I'm going in. Cover me! Oh, you're just gonna go in all by yourself. 
honestly, that guy could get attacked by like all all the Team Plasma guys in there and get get his butt kicked. Okay, this time I'll join the fight. Come on, Bianca, you too. What? Well, wait, Z, you come too. Okay, I'll come. Because I was definitely planning on just standing outside here. Actually, I am. No, I'm just kidding. Let's go inside and give Berg some backup. Okay. And look who it is. It's Yetis. My word. If it isn't the gym leader, Berg. So what would you say is the guiding principle of Team Plasma anyway? Take what you want from people? Bronius. Oh my goodness, that's something... It sounds like something you say to one of your friends. What up, Bronius? It's like, uh... What is that movie? I love you, man. When they're doing all the bro stuff. Bro... Bros of Stalin. Or Bronius. That would be a great name. To prepare a hideout right in front of the Pokemon gym. But we were detected more quickly than I imagined. Yeah, putting your hideout right in front of the Pokemon gym is a great idea. Indeed. No matter... We already have our ex an exceptional base of operations. Is everyone familiar with the legend of the founding of the Unova region? I am. It's the black dragon type Pokemon, right? In the other version, the black version, it'll say the white dragon type Pokemon. The truth is this. The black or white, depending on which version you have. Dragon appeared before a hero who sought an ideal way to knit together a world full of wa warring people. This black dragon type Pokemon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs at all at those who stood against it. Together, the power of this Pokemon and the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land. And that is how Unova was created. Wait, Unova was here before and then, you know, whatever. If we can win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create that world. The world that I, I mean Team Plasma, desires. Hmm, I'm starting to get a selfish feel from this guy. Anybody else? Everyone's way of thinking and lifestyles are very different. Honestly, there's something about the, what you're saying that I don't quite understand. One thing we all have in common is we should care a lot about Pokemon. Even people meeting Pokemon meeting for the first time can talk about Pokemon. They can talk, battle, or trade. It's true. And... At that time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. What you guys are doing? Aren't you going to? Aren't you going to strengthen the bond between people and Pokemon even more? Nice little laugh there. Yeah, ha 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 ha. But whatever. Quite hard to figure out. More intelligent than I expected. Wow. Didn't think we were smart. Nice underestimation right there, Gettys. I'm fond of intelligent people, you see. From every corner of the world, I have gathered knowledgeable people for the benefit of our king. Call it in the seven sages. Very well, we will submit to your opinion and be on our way. He gave up! He gave up! We won! We did it! Team Plasma's over. Maybe. Hopefully. I think it sounded like he said he just gave up. We don't even have to fight him. It's awesome. Money. Yeah, money! Pretty cool. I like that name, Bianca. That's actually a cool name. Why are you think why are you thanking them? They take your Pokemon. It's just I'm so happy to see my moon is safe and friendship between people and Pokemon can be very touching, but in order to liberate Pokemon for most people revive the legend of the Unova and win the hearts and minds of everyone farewell. It'd be awesome if we talked like that. And we are gonna let them get away because you know we got the Pokemon back, that's all we needed to do, and I'm sure we can defeat them some other time. Don't worry. What is everybody planning on doing now? Well, I don't know about all you, but I'm gonna kick Berg's butt. It's gonna be fun. Unfortunately, it's probably not gonna get done in this part because this is taking a lot longer than I thought it would. Also, thanks for looking for the Pokemon. Here, this is for you, and we get an item. The Yo. Don't even know. It's called the Yoshi Berry, even though it's an A, not no. I'm gonna call it the Yoshi Berry. It's the Yash Yashe. The Yashe Berry. See ya. And uh, wait! <laughs> she pushes Bianca out the door, I love that. Well then, Z, I'll be waiting in the gym. For me to kick your butt, right? And look, it's an item. Wonder what it is. It's the smoke ball! I don't remember what the smoke ball does. It does something pretty cool, though. But anyway, before we head on to fight this gym, there's one thing I want to do. We're gonna go get a Pokemon that should be helpful against, um,. His bug, t 
type Pokemon. I believe he also, he's, his main Pokemon in the anime was a Bug Grass type, so this will help ultra effective against this. But, um, you know what? I don't want to spoil what we're, where we're about to go, so I'm just going to come back when I find the Pokemon that we're looking for. I'll see you then. I found it! Second try and I found it! We're going to be catching a Darumaka, which will eventually turn into Darmanitan, the monkey ball po- I don't even know what that thing is, it's crazy. But we're going to go ahead and Rock Smash. Because the Rock Smash is awesome. Hopefully it doesn't do too much damage. Oh, I don't like this. I do not like this. I do not like this. Um, I got an idea. Let's just go ahead and try to catch it. I think we have enough here we can catch it. Um, let's use the... Might as well just use the... Actually, let's use a... Yeah, I'll use a Great Ball. So we're going to heal our Pokemon anyway. Why use a Great Ball? Because... It almost guarantees I can catch it. Hopefully. A, B, down, A, B, down. And we did it. We caught ourselves a Darumaka, which will be very helpful in our in our quest to defeat the Bug-type gym leader. And we got the 2 foot, 82 pound... Wow, that is fat Pokemon for how tall it is. That thing is going to die early. When its internal flame is burning, it cannot calm down what runs when, uh, when the fire diminishes, it falls asleep. It is the Zen Charm Pokemon because it has a Zen version and let's nickname it after my little cousin, Mr. Wrong. Uh, 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 okay, its nickname is going to be Mac, Mac the Do Darumaka and I probably shouldn't have shown you that but whatever. Let's go ahead and check out our new Pokemon. Let's see what it is. Got a brave nature. Often dozes off. That's not good. We got the... Oh, yes! Although, I don't like the whole part where his speed is down. But the attack is up, and this thing is a freaking massively huge attacking Pokemon. It's going to be awesome because it has some of the better attacking moves in the game. Oh, man. Special attack is terrible, but whatever. Um... And you know what? I'm just going to meet you back in Castilia City. See you in a little bit. Alright, as you may have seen, I'm just finished healing my Pokemon as the computer starts to freak out on me again. Um, the reason I went, went ahead and caught a Darumaka, I was going to go back and catch a uh, Pidove in the forest in order to help out with our exploits against Berg, because he is a Bug-type trainer. But then I realized... Um, Bug types are pretty weak to. F I think they're weak to fire, if I remember correctly. I probably should have looked that up before I did this, but I could have gone backwards and caught a P Dove, which I'm barely going to use. But I knew that Daramaka was on the uh, trail right ahead of us, so I went ahead and caught him. And now we're here at the Castilia City Gym. And whoa, this is a weird-looking place with lots of paintings. What do you think of Castilia City? I bet with all the bustling people you're starting to feel worn down on your way to the gym. Never mind, take this, it will help. We got the fresh water! Again, from the exact same guy. Awesomeness. The theme of this gym is walking through walls. Okay, so basically there's honey on the walls and um, it's hard to get through them as you can see, just watch, okay? Uh, uh. Oh, didn't make it. Basically, you just push as hard as you can, and eventually you'll get through. It's no problem. And you step on these switches to activate the doors, and eventually these doors will, if you get both switches, the doors will eventually uh, go down, as you can see right there. And But you have to get two switches to open each door, one on each side. Some of the switches are already open. I don't want to go through there. But as you can see, there's our first trainer, and I'm not going to do that in this part. We'll save that for the next part when we go through the Castilia City Gym. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. Um, be sure to like this video. Be sure to comment on this video. Tell me what you thought. And um, subscribe to my channel, Zman4491. And in the next part, we will take on the evil clown, as well as the rest of the Castilia City Gym and its honey walls. So I'll see you then.